I will be glad to announce that next week will get us away from the commentary maintenance. And like I said, the commentary maintenance and how that works is that basically any further video will be a commentary video until further change. But however, consider this video uh, probably going to be the last video in the commentary maintenance because I am very glad to say that we may be free from this commentary maintenance and pretty much like I said the commentary maintenance is uh, due to unforeseen circumstances and really I am thankful that the commentary maintenance strategy has been helping everybody out and pretty much how it's helping everybody out is that it's preventing a day in the Monday Wednesday Friday schedule from not having an upload at all so that way I still get videos uploaded on my Monday Wednesday Friday schedule and it's pretty good uh, the commentary maintenance I, I'm very glad because it also gives me more time to get my shit in gear and save my sorry ass now on to today's topic which is the Tokyo Game Show 2018 because that may be coming up right around the corner so yeah so what is this, what is TGS, what is Tokyo Game Show? Well, it's basically an entertainment expo in Japan. And what it is, is it basically showcases bigger news and upcoming games in the Japanese game industry. Basically, it's like E3, but in Japan. If you like to play the games from Japan more often, even localized or imported, this event will most likely hype you up. I expect to be surprised a lot. Of course, there is currently around to be upcoming as announced like Resident Evil 2 Remake and Devil May Cry 5 coming from Capcom. Like those are already announced and all that. That's what I've been hoping and trying to say. Yeah. But however, I'm predicting another Neptunia reveal, but really I'm more on the lines of surprise me because maybe we can see something that's going to hit us out of the bus. Maybe we could see some new IPs or pretty much see an existing IP and then go into an interesting direction. Maybe. we we. I'm not just saying. Like I'm saying, it surprised me. However, maybe we can see something to do with Uma Musume. But however, considering that is a mobile title, I doubt it. Though I do wish Uma Musume would come to consoles. And I think really... I don't care if it's Switch or PlayStation or pretty much PC, but really, to be honest with you here, I think Uma Musume is more of a good fit for Nintendo Switch owners. Definitely, I know we're going to see PlayStation make a debut there. However, I was going to say Xbox, but we will see about that because I realized that uh, Xbox, they're not doing so well in Japan. But however, if we do see Microsoft, no surprise. If not, no surprise either. I know Nintendo will definitely make a show up. I mean, we're probably going to see Nintendo Switch stuff at Tokyo Game Show. Speaking of Nintendo, there was supposed to be a Nintendo Direct, but they went to their official Twitter and announced that that Direct was canceled. Though, I wouldn't be surprised if a Nintendo Direct shows up around Tokyo Game Show time. But overall, I just want this year to surprise me. I anticipate, yeah. But uh, if you want to make a spinoff title that experiments with either VR or motion controls in some goofy or unique manner, more power to you. You want to shift to fan service for a bit, more power. You want to make something with lots of art in mind, more power. All I just want is basically for TGS to surprise me this year. All right, I will be getting myself together, and we will be back to normal. Like I said, I am working to get back in schedule, but I am also working to atone for the inconvenience. So right now, I want to come back swinging, but I want to come back swinging with fireworks. So not only will there be videos on that to-do list of mine, but there will be videos that will come out of nowhere. And with that said, that is on. I will be looking forward to you in the next video. Peace out. Yo, don't miss out on future shenanigans while at the same time no up ahead anything video related. I will be appearing on these other sites. Be sure to follow. Also, support the channel over at Patreon for just $1 a month. Come on down to the description box and you will find the links.